press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Well, I really like the way um, it is organized. I mean, the atmosphere is really good here. I mean, it, I feel to live in India, it is, the Chandigarh is the best city. I can think. I studied in Saint Stephen's school in Saint Stephen's school, so I, as well as I played football in Saint Stephen under Surinder sir. So you wanted to become a footballer? But when did you start football? Maybe it was my like. Uh, my dad and even myself, we I just wanted to utilize my free time into something. So I never thought that I'll be playing professionally or somewhat like that. So it just it was my dream to utilize my free time into some activities. So when your career started? I started my career as in you meant to say a professional career. Yeah. Professional. So the professional I've been playing for the country since I was under since I was 13. And by the professional, I signed my first professional contract in 2015. So I was in, I played in under 13 Indian national team and till senior team. So at the moment I'm playing in Delhi Dynamos. I, it is in ISL. So I'm playing there. So I have, I'll be playing the, this year as well. I mean, the league will be starting in October. You know, in India, football does not have that much of exposure and craze. So, yes. Yeah, but yeah, as everybody says, there is, I mean, the the craze of football is not that as popular as cricket. But what I think, uh, it is getting it is getting very popular nowadays since the ISL have started from IS, this in October it will be the fifth season of ISL. So I think since the ISL has been started, the improvement and the progress it is showing in football, it's a huge. In few states, it's getting really, really improved. And, and I mean, uh, even the players from India, I mean, they are getting the opportunity to show what they got in their self and the talent they have in their, in their selves. I mean, it is helping our football and our national team of India as well. So what's the difference between soccer and football? Uh, I mean in India we say uh, football and in Europe they say they say soccer. So both are similar? Both are similar, yes. So you would like to be a part of some European uh, football club like Manchester United? Yes, I, I, my personal point of view, I, I support Chelsea. A, a good, I mean, good club in England, but I want to play as long. I want to play in India, and I want to take my country as high as I can. And I all, I, I also want my colleagues and my players to support me, and and I want to, you know, I want to take my country as high as I can. So yes. if you talk about the country, right? I'm not touching any religious part, right? Yeah. So just want to know that your name is Muhammad Sajid, right? Yes, yes. So have you ever faced bias system in our country? No, never. I person it, it is my personal view that I never faced any kind of thing like that. Now it's fair enough. I think whoever whoever got the talent and they have a right to play for India. So, so even if I want to give a message to every young man, every young, I mean, whatever they say in football, it is real. You, you have to work hard as much as I can, and I, I promise your day is not far to get success. Because nowadays, India and Pakistan is going up really high. Yes. You do some terror. Today, is, today itself. Yes. The decision uh, came for Jammu, for Jammu Kashmir. Kashmir. Yeah, but I think so. I'm, well, I'm not into, into that kind of things and I never heard about it. If I personally say, if you have a talent to go and show what you can do for the country, no, but nobody can stop you. To be neither you're Muslim or any kind of religion you are. It is what you have. All right. And uh, if you talk about the youngsters, because you are young, right? Yes. So, what exactly the ins inspiration you are giving to them um, from your side? Well, 
the inspiration uh, I'll be giving to them is like you, you have to work hard I mean nothing can be achieved by sitting at home so you have to work hard for anything you do in in your careers no I know there'll be up and downs in your life but you don't have to get demotivated and leave it I mean the time you get demotivated and leave it then I mean you, you lose in everything but you have to focus in the things which you need to focus which which you are working hard for so you have to work work hard until and unless you get onto that level so i really uh, appreciate the students or the youngsters who are working hard in any career they need to work hard and they need to keep motivated and in inspired by the things you watch one more thing i would like to know that the, in, in, in the sports industry right the, everyone said do you do rumors or trolls we don't have a comment regarding those things but they are saying that whenever they go to the field they used to be drunk and then they go to the field. uh well it de it depends where you are going it depends where you are going and it is the thing uh, in professionalism it doesn't work i mean i, I can say in just a normal things it it, can, it might work the people might drug and play but it's not the I mean, if you're having drugs and play, I mean, there's no use of you playing any sports. But in a professional career, you never ever go by drugging, doing uh, doing something wrong and then performing yourself. And it's totally wrong. Hello, I'm Mohammed Sajid. You're watching this show time. Do subscribe to this channel and like and comment. Thank you.